Welcome to Wildlife Wednesday. If you want to see some trout up close, you can come to Montana Wild and check them out in our aquarium. But special today, we joined our local fisheries biologists as they studied the fish in nearby 10 Mile Creek. And they're going to show us how they use electrofishing to learn more about the fish that live in the streams and rivers around Helena. One of the best ways to sample small streams and creeks are to use a technique of electrofishing called backpack electrofishing. What we're doing here is we're trying to get an idea of the fish abundance in this creek. The fish are attracted to the yellow probes that you see in the water called an anode and it stuns those fish temporarily allowing the netters to pull those fish out of the creek and put them in buckets that have water that is not currently being shocked. The crews are not only successfully shocking fish, but they're getting multiple different kinds of species. We're seeing suckers, brown trout, sculpin, rainbow trout, um, brook trout, uh, and, and there's always a chance we could get something that we never anticipated. And that's why we do these surveys to better understand fisheries like that of the fishery in 10 Mile Creek. All right, so fisheries crews, then after they're done sampling fish, we have to take lengths and weights on them. In order to handle the fish, we have to put them to sleep. We use uh, something called clove oil, which numbs the fish so we can handle them more easily. Basically then they process the fish. Brown trout. Just like that, and then we release them in a live well for them to recover. And once they're recovered, we will release them back in the stream. Thanks for coming to another Wildlife Wednesday, and we'll see you next week.